Welcome to this week's Swarf and Chips. Woohoo! I am so happy that we're finally back on the road again. And guess where we travel to today? DMG Mori UK in the heart of Coventry. Now we have three very important topics that we're going to cover with you. So number one is the accessible and unique finance options that they have to offer. Number two, well, as a company, we believe that the key to survival is lights out running and automation. So we'll see what DMG Mori's offerings are here. And number three are the deals on the stock that they have got that is readily available. So welcome to today's Swarf and Chips. Steve, how have DMG Mori been dealing with the past few months, but also what have we got to look forward to in the future? Yeah, the last three months have been difficult. Um, we all shocked middle of March. Um, we've all started working from home, but actually the important thing is we've kept the customer base going by maintaining our service field guides. So moving forward to the future, um, I can see a very positive mode. We've seen some indications from Europe, how they've picked up when they've gone back to work. Um, and I, I'm sure that's going to happen in the UK. UK manufacturing is strong. Um, I would like to see some of the big companies actually make sure that they contract the work with inside the UK um, to keep that even stronger. So um, we were probably floating uh, in March around about 50% on order intake, around about 60% on service work. We're now up to 75% on service work and around about 65% on order intake. So things are climbing steadily and very, very positively. Well, that's good to hear. And I know you've got some machines here, so let's go see them. So the NHX 4000 from DMG Mori, this is a horizontal machining center. I want to talk to you about not just the machine, but the palletization on here as well, because this is very much about lights out running. Now, a horizontal machining centre can replace several verticals, and we believe at MTD CNC this uh, is not common enough in the marketplace because a horizontal can be a very productive solution on its own. Now, as I open the door to this machine, the first thing to note when you talk about production is the speed of it. Now, this actually has a 20,000 RPM spindle. What's great about the DMG Mori spindles is these are actually uh, Speedmaster spindles and they come, or well, this particular machine comes with the Speedmaster model which has a three year warranty. That just shows how much confidence they have in their own product. Here you can see the first pallet. This is where you would obviously load up the cube with components and imagine if you could have two parts, three parts, four parts per face, the machine and the spindle would keep turning. Now, what I really want to talk to you about when it comes to lights out is the palletization. So here you have a 21 pallet RPS system. Now you can get 400 kilograms per pallet on this machine. And you can see there, you've got a micro lock cube in order to, uh, to hold the components. Now, why do you want to go for palletization? If you come around this way a bit further, you'll be able to see here uh, another cube with parts on. Now this is impressive. Look at the amount of components that you can present to the spindle, but not just the amount. Look at the faces on the components, the side faces, the front faces. It means that you are essentially machining more faces in one, uh, in one cycle with this machine. Uh, palletization gives you lights out machining. And this machine will keep running over a weekend. It will keep running overnight. Um, and as a result of it being at a DMG Mori with things like the Speedmaster spindle, you know it's going to do that without missing a beat. Steve, this is a very versatile machine, but in your view, where would this actually fit into the UK market? Well, the machine behind me is a NHX 4000. We've recently sold one into a general subcontractor. We've got them in, uh, we've got one being installed into an aerospace company, uh, an OEM. We've got a number of them in medical companies, so pretty universal application. And what sort of package can you actually offer into the market at the moment through finance, for instance? Finance is really important. This machine, around about £570,000 less. That's a lot of money for anybody to fork out on. So the idea here is that the machine can go in, it can run for six months before that you pay us any money, any deposits or start the payments, six months. In that six months, you could generate around on this particular machine comfortably £157,000 worth of revenue. Now that gives you a real, a real bounce into uh, before you even start making any payments. 
So here we have the DMC 65 monoblock five axis machining center. Now we've, uh, we've looked at a lot of these machines, had the pleasure of actually going to Fronten where these machines are built. And the first thing I would point out is the accessibility of the machine and the robustness of the build. The way the table here is actually supported both sides. Swarf evacuation is great, it goes out the back of the machine and of course your x-axis here is moving on the column. Now when you are using a five axis machine you're going to have to go into the machine and change the part and reset parts. With an RPS system like we have here, this RPS3, you don't need to do that. You can set the components off of the machine and that's the big theme on this week's Swarf and Chips. It's about making sure that this here, this spindle, this high speed, powerful spindle is cutting to the optimum amount of time, increasing efficiency. And this sort of system, an RPS3, will enable you to do that. Fully integrated, a DMG Mori product throughout, all controlled by the one control that we have here. Uh, DMG class themselves, or DMG Mori class themselves, as five axis champions. And you can see by looking at machines like this and the amount that they have in the field, uh, the reasons why. Steve, we've had the privilege to be with you in Fronten in Germany. You make over a thousand monoblocks a year from that factory, but tell us a little bit about where you think this machine would actually fit in uh, globally. Well, from a UK perspective, we sell right across the board into tool rooms, into OEMs, into the Formula One sports. Um, so it's a very versatile machine. Um, it's a good workhorse. It's a double trunnion um, and it's a very, very strong, rigid uh, machine and as you say over a thousand sold per year uh, and that is being maintained at the moment. And are you selling many of these machines without a automation system? We sell at the moment more without automation but the demand for the customers is coming more with the automation. And when you look at the actual uh, packages and the cost and the finance on this machine what, what does DMG Mori UK actually offer on the monoblocks? Well the monoblock is a very affordable machine um, we would finance this through DMG Mori Finance, which is our own book, um, and we can make all sorts of tailored packages, but the standard one for us is um, no payments for six months, no deposits, no payments. That gives the customer the opportunity to start manufacturing parts and generating revenue from that point of view. So we will support that all the way through as we try to support UK manufacturing. And finally, do you, do you have stock ready to actually be delivered in the UK? We have the machine behind me stock, we have uh, another mo Monoblock 75 in stock, we have a two more coming um, and they're readily available from the factory on around about a two to three month delivery. So now we're talking turning and milling all in one machine with this CTX uh, 800. Now there are two spindles on this machine, it is ideal for one hit machining, part in, or billet in, component out. With this head here, you'll notice, now we're obviously tipped up uh, the B axis at the moment, but this is a very, very small, it's as, it's as wide as it is high, um, and it's a full wrap round spindle, it's an HSK 63, so power and speed. But the fact that it's so small means that you don't have to increase the footprint of the machine to avoid collisions. You can see here, when you drop this down, there is very little, well, th there's very little opportunity for collision still within a tight working envelope. And this really does save on uh, footprint of the machine and still means you can make those slightly larger components. But do you want to be loading a part like that by hand? No, you don't. You want to be using something like this, a robo to go to get that lights out machining. Now this uh, robot will pick up raw billet and also take completed parts out of the second spindle. Fully integrated, one solution from DMG Mori. And it's amazing how many of these types of solutions are selling now around the UK because really you want to make sure that both of those spindles are turning uh, to the optimum amount of time to increase your efficiency. And I know Steve's got a great story uh, about a new customer that's actually purchased this machine. Well, the, the machine is actually going to a company that's a startup company. Um, and as I know it, the guy really works on his own, so he wants the robot as his companion and to actually do the work for him while he's programming the next job. But the real strength behind that opportunity, not just the technical ability of the machine, but was the fact that we can finance it through DMG Mori Finance. Relatively easy, startup company on this kind of investment. It really took some, some sharp intake of breath, I think, from some other companies, but in our case, it was very, very straightforward. And um, we're very pleased and delighted to support UK manufacturing in this way. 
and it's nice to see a different type of automation with the robo to go. Have you got this uh, set up uh, ready to go in stock? Uh, this one is probably about a three month delivery now. Um, we have NLX 2500 coming in with robo to go uh, and we have NCX coming in which is uh, of a similar configuration of the machine behind me. So really the message from uh, DMG Mori UK is that you, there's lots of inquiries around and, and obviously a lot of companies are talking to you. Yeah, we're getting quite good business now and we're getting good opportunities. I think people are looking a lot harder at the automation. You know, exactly what I've just said here. The guy here, this is his companion. This is his best friend. He's going to do all the work for him. Um, and that's how people are thinking a lot more uh, along those lines. Thank you for watching today's show. We hope you've learned something. I certainly have. You know, when you're making money like that before even putting down your first payment, it's pretty fascinating. And there's a great example. A couple of weeks ago, we went to a customer that uh, bought their first DMG Mori. It was a monoblock 75. Uh, yes, it was 75. And I tell you what, Lindsay, they're so pleased with the backup and service from DMG Mori UK, but they could not afford that machine. They were going to go for a lower spec machine, but because they could get the finance, they can future proof their machining facility, it's fantastic. And the whole portfolio from DMG Mori is huge, isn't it? I mean, I guess, why wouldn't you consider a DMG Mori machine? Well, it, obviously we're trying times at the moment, you know, industry's gone through, uh, you know, a, a critical stage like a lot of industries have, but we're very strong in, in the UK with lots of different machining complex parts, let's say, and the more sophistication, the more automation, lights out engineering, you know, it, it, it's all about that and DMG Mori can offer everything plus, you know, you imagine actually owning a machine for six months and not pay a penny, how much can you actually earn on that? Yeah, and that's echoed by the confidence of Steve. So thank you for watching the show. We've also got a podcast coming out shortly, uh, which Steve has done with yourself and Paul. So look forward to that. Um, and as we always say, keep those, those spindles, spindles turning. turning.